Uh, this is the Liberia National Television coming to you live from Monrovia, Liberia. The President of the Republic of Liberia, His Excellency George Manawia, is making his way to the Antoinette Tubman Stadium in central Monrovia for this much publicized. One million citizens rally, and it's happening here today, Saturday, 4th of February 2023. The president is marching along with scores of supporters. gathering of party people and those loyal to the president. I'm now with Gume and I'm here. And the president is way there in the crowd. He's marching alongside the first lady, Madam Claire Weir, and scores of high ranking officials of the government. I see. Then Eugene Nambe, Commissioner General of the Maritime Authority. And we are somewhere around the Ministry of Foreign Affairs at the moment. And that's Another crowd ahead of us here. Bystanders are also here. And the president is dressed in dominant blue. He's way in the crowd there. Blue cap. With dominant blue color of a uh, purple suit. And he's been flanked by the chairman of the CDC. Over Malu, way there in the middle of the crowd. What do you want to do? You gotta move on your chest, my friend. 
Where were you? Where you here? Are you hungry? Where? 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 Liberian National Television is coming to you live from Monrovia. The President of the Republic of Liberia, His Excellency George Weir, is moving and marching on the nation's capital, particularly central Monrovia, as part of this one million citizens rally. Here comes the President of the Republic of Liberia, His Excellency Ambassador George Mana Weir. Government songs have been played all around the place as partisans of the CDC dance to the rhythm of the song. And there's another foot right back there. Liberia, His Excellency, George Manawea, is here, and I also, I also see Foreign Minister D. Maxwell Kimaya, and on the right hand side of the First Lady is the Minister of State with our portfolio, Chokong Kui, scores of government officials, supporters, 
and superstars of the vicinity are here. Hey, As the president march, uh, marches on Monrovia. Right now we are between the Capitol building and of course uh, the Stidman University of Liberia. And that's the executive mansion. Protocol, the head of protocol at the executive mansion of Bono. Binda Bondo, the executive manager, chief of protocol, is also in her uh, CDC regalia, dressed in her CDC regalia. I also see Percy Yeke, the executive director of the Liberia Agency for Community Empowerment List. Schools of government officials are here as a matter of fact. We are on Capitol Hill at the moment, particularly between the Capitol Building, the Capitol Building and the State Bond University of Liberia. This is the Liberia National Television bringing you this event. And here is Seku Kalasko Damaro. He's also doing a live podcast. Executive Master Chief of Protocol Finda Bono. There. And here comes the president and his interact. ahead of us there. A huge turnout of 
supporters, sympathizers, and party faithful. Executive National Chief of Protocol Finna Bono is also leading another team on the other side. And she's flanked by the Executive Director of Liz Pesci Yeke and several others as you see. The President of the Republic of Liberia, His Excellency George Bria, is going to be presented to the coalition by the Congress for Democratic Change as the man to contest on the coalition ticket. That ceremony will take place. The president will be nominated today as the standard bearer of the governing coalition for democratic change. And I heard of that uh, the president has decided to to march along with his supporters as you see them in the background chanting different slogans but all in support of George Weir some are saying different things
There are bystanders also taking pictures. Well, we are almost around the Jalata Junction. Uh, you see up there is, uh, for some of you who know Central Monrovia. You have to understand what I'm talking about. It's a mass gathering of citizens who have come Show love and support for the re-election bid of President George Weir, who is seeking re-election in October 2023 presidential and legislative election. This is a build-up to the much-anticipated presidential and legislative election that will be held on the 10th of October 2023. Here is the president.
number is increasing. The number keeps increasing. The number keeps increasing here. There are times the president will have to stand a bit for the crowd to go ahead and then he picks up and there he comes way back there. Why you leaving? Why you leaving? 
Can you help me here? Ain't no ear busy? I want, I want to try it. I'm an ear busy. I want to try it when you're good. Can you help me here tomorrow? Okay, I'm going to get out of the the UN drive towards the ATS. The president the president is marching marching along with his supporters right here in central Monrovia 4th of February 2023 a build up to the, 20, the October 10th presidential and legislative election. The President of the Republic of Liberia is seeking re election comes October and is expected to be nominated and stand up there of the governing party, the CDC, to run for a second term. And this is the occasion. This is the moment. And you see the euphoria. Not far from the ATS, we are somewhere around UN Drive Clay Street intersection. UN Drive Clay Street intersection. Any moment from now, we will be at the ATS where the official program is taking place. The nomination of the President of the Republic of Liberia, President George Weir, as standard bearer of the governing coalition for democratic change, to run for a second term. That event is taking place and this is what has greeted the occasion, mass turnout of citizens from all walks of life. And we are told that this is happening. This celebration or such gathering is happening simultaneously across the country. Already, the governing party announced that their support was are gathering in seven regions of the, of the country. Manserado is one, Bong County is one, Lofa is one, Nimba is one, and you have all those from the southeastern counties converging in Zweju, Grand Jida County. So, It is just what it is. The Liberian National Television coming to you and bringing you exactly as the issues are for.
Hey then. The president is managing his way through the crowd. And I'm told that what is ahead of us is quite more than what you are seeing through our lens here. I'm told that uh, the ATS is already packed, jam packed to capacity. want to imagine to wonder how the president is going to make his way through this huge gathering of citizens here today Ellen TV coming to you from central Monrovia I already at the ATS, the Antonio Topman Stadium, named after the former president William, named after the wife of former president William V. S. Topman, deceased the president. As a matter of fact, this is the Antonio Topman Stadium, the ATS. The famous ATS where this exercise is taking place today. As I was telling you, this stadium was named in honor of the wife of former Liberian President William V. S. Tuckman. And that lady was referred to as Antonin Topman. So this is the Antonin Topman Stadium, eight years.
got that huge turnout. And I'm wondering how the president is going to make his way through this crowd onto the ATM. And the crowd keeps increasing. The number keeps increasing. A mass gathering of supporters of the governing CDC.